Welcome back! <sighs> Hello! What's, what's up, guys? You bunch of ass chocolate. I'm going back to Detroit. Become human. And uh, I've been cranking these out pretty quick, and I'm very happy that I'm uh, actually on a good track right now. So I already got two episodes out on this. This is the third. So we're going to crack down on this, get into this. Uh, where we left off is we were with the nanny, and we just killed Todd. <laughs> I hate Todd. Uh, and we're stuck in the rain because we got kicked off the bus because we're an android. So uh, that's where I left off is that we were stuck in the rain. So that's kind of like where I was just going to go off of. Um, I think it should lead off right there. But if not, I'll just kind of do some editing and fix it. So I just want to do a quick episode while I'm, you know, hanging out. And uh, get, keep going. I want to get this uh, storyline going because I actually really want to play this right now. So I have to film it. So let's play. Detroit. Become. Human. Okay, guys. Uh, it actually did start off exactly where I left off. So thank God. Um, find shelter for the night. Oh, it's giving me choices. Uh, I don't want to go to a bus bench. I think that's too... But... Uh, shit. I almost like want to break into an abandoned building or something. Wait, what's over here? Let's see what this does. We need a place to stay. Do you know anywhere we could spend the night? Thanks, Chad. <laughs> what a dick. All right. Come on. Can you grab my hand? Thank you. All right. That was cute. A motel. Oh, wait. Won't open before morning. Well, shit. Oh, what's this? Open 24-7 can't stay. Why is that? It's open 24-7. What's this? That doesn't look safe. I'm sorry. Okay. I don't have money. Oh, shit. There's a lot of stuff. Okay. Shop is closed. I'm thinking it's telling me to do it there. What's this? Uh, all right, let's go ask for help. Grab my hand, you little idiot. No! Grab my hand. Hey! What the... She's like on her own game plan right now. What the hell's going on? How are you doing? Alice, you're freezing cold. I'm okay. I'm not so cold. You look lost. Oh, shit. We have nowhere to go. I know someone who can help you. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. Yeah, that wasn't sketch. Come on, Ellis. Thank you for using Detroit buses. All right, I'm going to go ask first because I have a feeling I'm supposed to go over here and ask. <clears throat> If this all takes too long, I'll Look, skip it. But... Open. Maybe we should go inside. At least you'll be out of the cold. What do you want? Jeez. I'm with a little girl, and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? Shit. 
A homeless android? Ah, that's the best yet. Look, this is a convenience store, not the Salvation Army, okay? You better go if you're not gonna buy anything. Oh, I can't do that, dude. Oh, I have a gun. Oh, son of a bitch. Uh, I'll come back. I'll come back. I'll come back. I'll come back. Ooh, I bet she's pissed. She's like, man, I'll, I'll fuck that dude up. Excuse me, sorry. I wish there was a run button. Let's just go over here, try this first, I guess. There's nobody outside right now. Okay, there's a motel over here I wanted to check real quick. It's warm in here. You'll feel better in no time. How do I change my clothes? Okay. Oh, he's asleep. Get him. What are you doing? They're not our clothes. We need them, Alice. You need something warm, and I need to get rid of this uniform. But that's stealing. We can't do that. We need it. Sorry, Alice, but we have to do this. Hurry up. Grab it. Run. Grab, 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 grab. I know Alice isn't going to like me too much for that, but... Oh. Ooh, that was smooth. Dude, stop! Oh, I have to hit multiple things. I don't like this. Alright, go. Scram. Innovative laundry scene. Changing. Oh. I don't want to read that shit. Uh, it's cool that they add the magazine thing, but I don't like doing it. Got us some clothes now. I just want to make sure I go over all the options because, uh, wait, I have no money for the motel, but maybe they'll feel bad. I don't know. No androids allowed. $40 payment advance. Ah, oh, shit. We're not going in? We can't, Alice. I don't have any money. We have to find $40. Or go somewhere else. Oh, do I have to rob that place? Uh, I don't want to do that. They're going to find me. Come on, grab my hand. Grab my hand. There you go. That's one of the options, I guess. I have to get the money from that uh, convenience store. I don't want to do that, but... I don't want to go in there either. I think I'll. I think we'll get in trouble. I mean, like, we'll get our asses kicked or something in there. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Kara, I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night, and no one will look for us here. 
Hmm. Wire cutters. Oh my. Where the hell am I supposed to get wire cutters? Find wire cutter. What kind of game is this? Mm. Ugh. I guess I don't need wire cutters, right? I don't want her to think uh, worse of me. Uh, that's why I don't want to rob the convenience store. Um... I don't know where to find wire cutters. I don't know why I keep saying find wire cutters. Uh, oh, this might be where wire cutters are. Let me just say wire cutters one more time. Oh, maybe I have to go to the convenience store and steal wire cutters. Eh, screw it. I'll do the car. It looks abandoned. Come on, girl. Stand back, Alice. Well, yeah, that will protect you from the rain now. Smart. Cat's gonna go here. It's dry inside, and nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. Can't we find a better place? Okay. Okay. I, I want her to be cool with me because I better. I did steal the clothes and it probably freaked her out. <clears throat> Come on. I'll find you a better place, you little spoiled shit. Oh, what's over here? Wire cutters. Yeah, wire cutters. Alright, she said she would sleep in the house, so... I think. I don't know. She's gonna sleep in the damn house. <clears throat> Clip. Oh my god, come on. I was about to say, don't make me do all that, please. Innovative! Are you alright? Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. Don't worry, we're just having a look. Find a way in. God dang, man. Is this ever gonna end? There's gonna be people here, I'm telling you, dude. It's like a homeless paradise right here. Hurry up, Alice. Damn it. Damn. House ain't no joke. I don't like this place, like, at all. But... I can't go rob that place. I just can't do it yet. Alice? Oh. Alice! Um. Take Alice. Take Alice inside house. I'm. I don't even know where fucking Alice went. Oh. Oh. Wait, what are you doing? Visitors. Ralph doesn't like visitors, they're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. Uh. Uh, 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 uh. I'm an android. Look, I'm an android too. We have nothing to be afraid of. All we want is a place to spend the night. 
Come on, dude. Oh. dangerous. No, 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 no. Look. Relax. What they did to Ralph. Holy shit. Excuse Ralph. Ralph still finds it difficult to control himself. Sometimes his fear makes him do things he regrets. Ralph has seen some hard times. He's just so scared the humans will get him again. You can stay if you want. Ralph won't hurt you. Okay. We'll just stay the night. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I Come think I made on. a bad choice. <laughs> this way. Oh. Ralph has lived here since he ran away. Ralph never he... goes outside, so no one knows he lives here. Humans come in to squat from time to time, but I you know, Ralph he... just hides till he leaves. <laughs> okay, Ralph. Oh God, don't do any dumb, anything dumb, Ralph. Please. I want to trust Ralph. I feel bad for Ralph. You can make yourself at home here. Ralph is gonna go into the other room. He would like to stay with you. But he has things to do. It's just for one night, Alice. We'll find a better place tomorrow. Yeah, the one and only night you're gonna be alive. Sorry, Alice. Right. Let's see where you can sleep. Sit down and I'll start a fire. Man, what you have to do when you're running away from the law? <laughs> Ugh. Make a bed for Alice. <gasps> Excuse me. All right. All right, I think I will make her a fire first. Okay, got paper. Oh, that's for her bed. Okay. No, I don't want to set up the bed yet. Oh, RA9! Just like that one droid said, RE9, RE9, RE9. Oh, this looks like a crack den. Wood, 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 wood. Shit, I might have to set this crap down first. Don't jump at me, don't jump at me. This looks like a horror game. There's something I, I have a feeling he killed somebody and he's like keeping them here Yeah, I think I have to set up the bed first Hold on. God dang it. Whoa. All right. That's not screwed up Dude, I'm on edge right now I just keep thinking about uh, Ralph right now. Thought I needed wood. <coughs> yeah, I do need to get wood. I think there might be wood upstairs. Oh! One plank of wood. Oh, I'm about to do this. Innovative. You can come to bed. 
I did what I could. It's not much, but at least you'll be warm. Poor little Alice, man. I'm gonna go talk to the psychopath in here. RA9. What does that mean? What? <laughs> Those symbols. Why are you writing that? I don't know. I don't know. Do your head in the sink, that's great. He ever loved me. Why was he always so upset with me? All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. Screwed up. That's why he was always so angry. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Graphics look great. Why can't we just be happy? It's a little I'm dark. Nervous. You'll never leave me, right? I promise you'll never go. I promise, Alice. Yeah. I promise. Will we be together forever? Forever. Forever. It's interesting music that they have, that noise that they're using. That boo boo it's kind of cool. That's an android feel. Dude, I don't want that android to be dead. The detective, I really like that guy. <clears throat> Had like that homicide aspect of it. I hope they go back to him or, or bring him back or something. Put his memory in a new person, something like that. Sleep tight, Alice. Uh. Mmm. Leave her space. Shit, this one's hard. Damn, I. I kind of want her to like sleep and stuff, but I don't think there's anything else I could do, so I'm just gonna lie with her. She feels comfortable. She just talked about how she wished she had a normal little family, so I'll just show her some compassion. Mmm, sleep mode. I'm an idiot, sorry. The most, like, sensitive part of the scene, and I'm acting like a moron. Holy shit, like how many options there are. God damn! That's the motel. I did a, lo a lot of it, I guess. I could have robbed it, see? Look how much that would have went. But I have a feeling I could have probably died. Look, it all led to like one scene where I probably die. But see, I did. I think I'm supposed to do that one. Because look how far it went. Inside laundry bin. Alright, let's keep going. Very interesting. I like it. What in the hell is that? Is that a head? Oh, shit. Wait a minute. What the hell? No.
No! What the hell just happened? Oh, they probably destroyed me because that fucking guy. Oh no, dude, they screwed me up. Unable to stay. Oh my god, they ruined me. Replace legs? It looks great right here, but holy shit. Dude, it's straight up Terminator right now. We'll take it. Dude, this is screwed up. Oh, I hope he. I'm gonna kill that that brother. I mean the son. Uh, if I if I run into him again, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna. I have to. This guy, that kid, that kid killed me, dude. He, well, almost killed me, but kid's got it coming. Killed Carl. Right? Had a bull. Oh. Dude, there's so many of them that sucks. I got legs. It's screwed now, bro. I got legs. I'm coming for you. Oh, this is like a horror movie. That sucks. I feel bad for him. I knew that was gonna scare me. I saw it a mile away and it scared the shit out of me. Oh, look at that. Oh, that gave me a, oh, my heart. Oh, shit, that sucked. Please don't scare me again. Oh, get the hell out of here, dude. This, that's awesome looking, but holy shit, that's scary. Oh, no, 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 no. Dude, this is, this is horrible. I like it though, it's good. Whoa. Dude, that's, that's pretty sad. Damn, I gotta put myself back together. Okay, alright, let's go. How about this dude? He's moving. Oh my god, it's tweaking out! Dude, this is amazing. I actually really like this part. Oh! 
again. It's getting me, man. Not even a horror game. <clears throat> Just so you guys know, when I'm done with this series, I'm gonna, I'll do a really good horror game so you guys can see how big of a pussy I am when it comes to horror games. Yeah, here we go. I have to do it, dude. She's already dead. Come on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to. Hurry up. I was thinking about... The horror game I wanted to do really bad, because I liked the first one, was Layers of Fear. And they came out with a Layers of Fear 2, which I am super stoked about. I love the first one, so I'll do the second one for, you know, my channel. And you'll see how horrible I am when it comes to horror games. Oh, is I? Yeah, this is, this is not going to be traumatic. I'm an AK-700 android. I was designed to serve you. What can I do for you? Give me your eye. Hello. I'm an My program has detected an anomaly. Please contact the nearest cyber life maintenance center. Hey. Oh my god, it's like a death pit. Compatible. Okay, this is much easier. Compatible. Incompatible, good. Compatible. LA 900. I don't know which one's better. I'll do that one, I guess. He's gonna grab me. Here we go. Oh, you idiot. Come on. All right. Hold it. Hold it. Come on, buddy. Push, push, push. You got this. You got this. You got this. Climb this shit! No! 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 I'm hitting it! I'm hitting it! I'm hitting it! You're out! You're out! Ooh, dramatic orchestra. Looks great, man.
Please tell me he has some kind of recording device or something that caught the son killing his dad. What is that? Oh! Oh no, no, don't do that. He took, how did he do that? I'm confused. Oh, dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. My name is Terminator. Marcus. Oh shit. I'll be back. Oh, Terminator jacket, there we go. Hmm. Okay, let's keep going. Bum 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 bum. Bum 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 bum. Oh, that's the detective. What? He's alive. What in the hell is this? I meant like Willy Wonka's Chocolate Factory. What the hell? <laughs> Keep going. This place is gorgeous. Hello, Amanda. Connor. It's good to see you. Your predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. It knew deviance could be unpredictable, but it wasn't careful enough. I hope you won't make the same mistake. I don't intend to. When a Connor model is destroyed, its memory is transferred to the next one. But some data can be lost in the process. Avoid being destroyed. It will be better for you and the investigation. I understand. The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This... Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? I think he's irritable and socially challenged. But I also think he used to be a good detective. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Pick up the investigation where the previous Connor left off and put a stop to this. Am I a new Connor? Is that what's going on? Hurry, Connor. There's little time. So the other Connor got shot and I, I'm a replacement Connor. Interesting. I like his shoes. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. <laughs> Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. <laughs> I 
You might be in shock. Tensions in the Arctic have reached a new level. A Russian carrier and an American patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. Several warning shots were exchanged, apparently with no damage or casualties to either side. The Minister for Defense, Dennis Riggs, has spoken of intolerable provocation that cannot go unanswered. The countries in the region, particularly Sweden and Canada, So far, there has been no response from either Moscow or There it is. Found it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. He's gonna go back from the dead, are we? <laughs> Learn about him, okay. There's a lot of stuff. What the hell? Hi, Chupa. It's my cat. Okay. On with it. My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. God, I saw you get shot in the head last night. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. But Cyberlife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. This incident should not affect the investigation. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office! Ah, shit. Ten new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I gotta be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. <clears throat> Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. 
No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. I'm standing right here. You are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. That went great, didn't it? Mm. I wonder whether Lieutenant Anderson is really the best person for this investigation. Hey, I don't need a machine to tell me how to handle my men, okay? So get the fuck out of my office. I said the wrong thing. Have a nice day, Captain. <laughs> what else is he supposed to say to that? I don't want to go check on him. He's going to beat the shit out of me. I understand the destruction of my predecessor may have been unpleasant for you, Lieutenant. I'll do everything I can to make sure it doesn't happen again. In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Little Matrix action right there. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. What the hell? How was I supposed to know he was at the damn bar last night? Or was I there when that happened? You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair's on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? Lab report says they cut it with What's something. it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. We really need the forensics. Alright, I'll chase it up. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I was wondering, is there any reason in particular you despise me? Yeah, there is one. Ah, shit. I was doing so good. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah. Too long. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop busting my balls, okay? If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. Missing.
243 files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. says they cut it with something. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move we past really the forensics. And hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? Uh, come on. I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. Or things are gonna get nasty. Uh, Lieutenant? I'm sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. Well, it didn't, uh, that didn't go the best, but <clears throat> I might cut it there. I might. Let's see. Let's just see where we're at, and we'll go from there. Oh, we're back at this. All right, I'm kind of interested in this one, so I'll uh, I'll just I'll do one more little chapter. Okay, check on her. Oh god, where did that crazy asshole go? Dude, it's gonna scare the shit out of me. Okay. He's gonna walk up right behind me and be like, me! Mm, I don't wanna steal it. I don't want that guy to flip out on me and try to kill me or something. I wasn't. That wasn't, uh. stealing. I don't want to read that. This 
back on the fire. Fire, fire, fire. Cut hair? No! I'm not gonna read that shit! Oh, there are scissors here. Oh, come on. <laughs> Looks like straight out of a salon, dude. What the hell? Oh, let's go, let's go white, completely, totally different, I like it, that's so awesome. I knew it! Was he a vagrant? What the hell? That's scary, dude. You, I can't. Oh, shit. Alright. That's all for now. Ready to go. Oh, no. We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay, well, let me know if they turn anything up. What are you gonna do with that? I have no idea. Oh, no. It took the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. It didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Maybe. this to feed the little girl <laughs> it's good for her a present to make up for past misunderstandings <laughs> Ralph will cook we will do just like humans do humans like burnt meat <laughs> come come and sit down That's better. <laughs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. It wouldn't be polite for her to refuse, would it? <laughs> Great. Great. <laughs> succulent, you'll see. Succulent. Succulent. <laughs> I wanna. Kill this dude. Girl. Please, Carl. I don't want to eat that. What did she say? 
I'll lie she right now. She said she can't wait to eat it. She's very hungry. The little human is not gonna regret it. <laughs> Ralph found the best, the biggest one he could find. <laughs> this is going to be succulent. Succulent. <laughs> Go ahead. Eat. Uh-uh. Woo! -uh. I saw the body upstairs. You killed that human, didn't you? No. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. You killed that man, Ralph. There's no point in lying. You hate humans, but you're just like them. You're a murderer. Ralph didn't mean any harm. No. It's just that... Ralph can't control his anger. When his anger comes, Ralph doesn't know what he's doing. He, he becomes stupid. Ralph is sorry. He just wanted to be your friend. Then let us go. Anybody home? There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Oh no. All right. I know this is bad, but I'm gonna cut it here. I'm sorry. I have to. This is a perfect moment to have another episode. Sorry, guys. I have to do it. I have to. I'm sorry. Oh, I want to play this so bad right now, but I can't. All right. I'm gonna be fair, and I won't play it, and I'll save this for the next episode. Episode four. That will be right there. Thank you guys for tuning in. Um, I'm really loving this game. This is like a crazy movie. Crazy movie. Some of these games that they make can be like made into movies and I would happily go and watch them. But anyways, thank you guys. Please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell for notification if you want. Um, and please, you know, keep checking in for some new updates and uh, some new videos and stuff like that. After this, like I said, I will do a horror game and show you how big of a puss I can be when it comes to a horror game. And I will get uh, Layers of Fear too. That's the one I really want to do, unless something else comes out. But anyways, thank you guys for tuning in to Zombie Gaming. I uh, appreciate it, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.